I'm very interested in this project because it's about inquiry-based science education, which is what we're trying to promote at all times in our course in Maynooth College. Also in our work with teachers in in-service training around maths and science education. And my own personal interest is around key skills and around the key skills for learning, like communicating, being personally effective, information processing, um, being critical and creative thinking and so on, information processing as I said. So what I like about inquiry-based science education is that you're, you're challenging the students to, to discover for themselves the science that they are um, observing and try and predict what's going to happen and explain. Um, and I think it's essential to do that, that if we, if we need our students to almost act like scientists, if we don't let them act like scientists, then they're not really going to learn the science in a conceptual way. And in Ireland, we, we've lots of different reports that talks about the problems around um, rote learning and around students just learning off for our final Leaving Cert exam, which is very, very high stakes exam in Ireland. So there's a lot happening around maths and science education in our country. And what particularly interests me about this project is that I might learn from three other countries as well, but also share what we're doing because we're doing quite a lot in Ireland. And we have new syllabuses in biology, chemistry and physics at Leaving Cert level and with new math syllabuses. So I think that that can fit, the, the, ex, ex, or the experience of Ireland can feed into what's happening in this project. We, in Ireland, traditionally, we've had a kind of a very um, linear model of CPD for teachers. In other words, we have like this expert that delivers and the teachers come away from where they're actually teaching. What I like about this project is it's asking teachers to look at inquiry-based science education, then to go back and try it in their classrooms, to share that with other teachers, and then to share it with other people online in a, in a community of learners. And I think that we need that as a small island community. Ireland needs that. We need to learn from what's happening in education in other countries. But we all, and we also need to challenge our teachers to a different way of professional development. And that's what's really good about this project is that it's going to challenge them to do that.